One thing I see frequently is people talk about their fears to their friends. I may not even be thinking about pranking you, but once you tell me your deepest fear, you're on my target list. Here's our evil clown cardboard cutout. Don't trust anybody. If you tell them the truth, all they'll do is hurt you. I really doubt that kid is gonna miss the 10 or 20 years you just took off his life. Okay, so last night, Garrett watched the fourth con, okay? We found out that he's terrified of aliens, okay? So we decided to make vacuum alien. Hey, easy fix for this prank, lock your door. What a coincidence. Aliens landed the same day you told your roommates that you were scared of aliens. Damn it. Okay, my favorite response to an alien being in your house ever is saying, damn it, and throwing a pillow at it half-heartedly. Freaking A, dude. Freaking A, dude, 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 freaking dude. Oh my gosh. I'm with you, dude. Sometimes you just gotta get so mad that you say, frick. Yeah, frick that. Damn it, guys. Freaking scared of aliens. Okay, aliens aside, please keep in mind that if you do get pranked, it's not the end of the world. Unless, of course, your biggest fear is that it's the end of the world. The United States Office of Civil Defense has detected a long-range nuclear missile launch in North Korea. Oh my God. Residents within a 400-mile radius of this area. He's a nuclear, a nuclear weapon. Let's all make fun of the weirdo who's scared of being blown up. Is he also scared of drowning and being shot? What a dork. What are you doing? The nuclear explosion was fake, but the poop explosion in his pants, all too real. That was not a joke, was it? Because that's not funny at all. Are you serious? <laughs> Can we give it up for the dad who's super cool? He tells his kid, you're a sick and then high fives him, because he respects the game. Luckily, our studio doubles as a fallout shelter, so dad and his scheming son agreed to come over for a chat. If you know the person, you know their deepest fears. I knew one of his deepest fears was a world war, so right away, I knew exactly what to do. A nuclear weapon! All I could think about was that I have to get my wife and my kids and try to get someplace safe, even though I didn't know where to go. That was not a joke, was it? Because that's not funny at all. I feel bad a little bit just because I know how serious he takes it and how I could have given him a heart attack. And when he mentioned that in the video, I kind of felt bad, but it was funny and everything's all right now. <laughs>